There are certain phrases that alter life forever. Will you marry me? We're pregnant. You got the job. I was expecting those words, but I never considered a paralyzing phrase like, you have cancer. This is not how I imagined life at age 25. The sun casts a shadow so that I know that it's time to stop feeling sorry. So we're about halfway done with the chemo. It's because it's so toxic that to stop feeling people can't sorry. Like, look at it or something. I thought I saw My name is Mike Lang, I'm from Calgary, Alberta. I'm 26 years old and I was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma about a year and a half ago. Vikram Bubber, my diagnosis was uh, rhabdomyosarcoma. Jared Brick, and at the age of 16, I was diagnosed with uh, pineal germinoma. One, two, three. Whoa! Peter Mazaru, I was diagnosed with KLL, which is acute lymphocytic leukemia. Carol Roby, I'm from Winnipeg, cervical cancer. Also Adams, 34 years old, esophageal cancer. Three and a half rounds of chemo and uh, a round of radiation. And I'm going to start again. One of the most difficult things is the not knowing. The transi transition hasn't been easy. Having this poison injected into my body, where do I fit in now? I was like a, an 85 year old man uh, in a 32 year old body. But the big story of life. for me is a ninja dictator thief. <laughs> <laughs>